Police departments are checking out a new technology to get to the truth and help protect all of us. It may sound simple, but it involves a lot of science. All to determine if you have lying eyes. You were asked to choose a number between two and nine. In just a few minutes. We'll ask you some general knowledge questions. Infrared lights are calibrated to a person's eyes. And then the computer takes over. Drum roll. This is always the moment of truth. If he's lying or telling the truth. The computer said that you were deceptive on the number six. Please be the number six. There we go. The company Converus is bringing a new type of lie detection to the world. It's called Eye Detect. In that little five minute test, we took about 30,500 measurements of your left eye and 31,000 measure, 30,500 measurements of your right eye. PhDs at the University of Utah created it in the early 2000s, partially funded by your federal tax dollars. But how it's being used now is what's new. We need to screen candidates to make sure that the officers that are out there to protect us uh, have not committed crimes in their past that would disqualify them uh, to be an officer of the law or a corrections officer. Pardons and parole officers are also checking it out to use on criminals, all based on pupil dilation. Eyes do dilate. That's one of the physiological reactions we do have when we're lying or scared or any other kind of uh, emotions that um, affect the body. Patrick O'Burke with the American Polygraph Association says he's been evaluating it for about 18 months now. It's somewhat less intrusive because we don't place components on a person's body. It simply looks at and looks at the pupils of the eyes. San Antonio is on the list of cities that may start using this new technology in the next several months.